Being a part of Claremont is everything. It's a family that you never expected to have. It's adopted aunties and uncles, adopted grandparents that you never expected that you would get. They always make you feel welcome. They're always asking how you are. Um, they want to see you do well in your life. And that's the kind of church that you want to be involved in. It's a place where I can learn about faith um, further, um, be encouraged by other people. It's actually a place where I feel I belong. It's an opportunity for me to make a contribution, to serve. It's not just a gathering of friends, it's much more deeper than that. I'm passionate a lot about working with the, the young people in Claremont, um, especially with their growth in their Christian journey. Um, part of that is with the rainbows and the brownies and guides and we do a lot of things with the feeder schools as well. We are always present and so a lot of the kids know our faces so when they ever they do come to this the church or the school or whatever they know that we are from the church so it's always good to know that there's a sense of community. The Boys Brigade is an important part of the, the, the church life. Um, it's, it's a way of um, getting boys obviously into the uh, into the church and even if they don't go directly from Boys Brigade to church the kind of lessons are still with them and some do come back and uh, you know maybe join at a later time. As a musician part of my role is to, to lead some of the, the music within within the church and that's that's getting that balance between um, traditional music but also for more uh, modern praise music there is a full full band and we're blessed with a whole over 20 musicians that we can use on a, a rota. For anyone who is thinking of coming along come along and speak to some of the folk and if you're a musician particularly we'd love to talk to you um, because there's always room for, for other people to come and share and have some fellowship together. I've been signing in the church for about 30, 30 years. Uh, for the first 15 years, there was really just one deaf person coming along, um, but now we have six or seven people coming, uh, not every week, although some come every week, uh, and it's really important for them uh, to be able to come, to feel part of a big church, uh, to know that other hearing people are welcoming them as well. We also live stream the service on a Sunday morning with me in the corner signing and that means that other deaf people can watch it at home as well if they don't have a church near that they can go on a Sunday morning. I've been here for a long time and I feel the church is a big part of my life. Uh, you would be very welcome to come along. Um, there's lots of different things happening in the church. Uh, you don't have to know a lot about the Bible or feel I'm a very, very good person. Just come along um, and learn a wee bit more about, about the people in the church but also about Jesus and how he can influence your life too.